अब आज हमारे साथ इतने डॉक्टर्स हैं सब क्लेम्ड है दिन रिकोगनाइज सर बाई द गवर्नमेंट इंदिरा जी अगर मैं आपसे ये सवाल पूछूँ हाउ डू थिंक सच अ बॉडी विथ हेल्प डिवेलप पॉलिसीज एंड ऑल्सो हैविंग एवरीबडी एट वन लेवल सारे जो एक्सपर्टीज हैं यहाँ पे पॉलिसी लेवल पर इसकी कितनी हेल्प होगी Actually, Amrika, I think this is an excellent suggestion, sir. If you look into some of the problems that we have in the country now, I'm from the public health sector. Uh, we find that, for example, diarrhea. If you look into undernutrition, these are major problems which, I, as a matter of fact, is still uh, being uh, it's still uh, worrying for the health ministry. These are issues. Undernutrition is still continuing, though we are talking of other things. He's talking of cancer. Arsenic is a major problem in the water, which causes cancer in Assam, West Bengal, all the eastern areas. So, so there is an intersectoral coordination because quite often uh, health is blamed for issues. Actually, the causative factor does not lie with health department. It lies with other department where wash. Uh, water sanitation hygiene these are very important issues so said so intersectoral coordination among various departments so that there could be more positivity so we have been talking for a long time about intersectoral coordination but if you look it's mostly between departments and ministries there never has been any independent intersectoral coordinating body among experts so sir so i think this body here has experts from various fields which can give a uh, transparent uh, you know not depending on what the government will say but advising very independently transparently to the government giving open suggestions for new ways to be opened for things to be continued fields not to be continued i think so this would be an excellent body to give a uh, sort of a, a way forward without any any baggage and secondly sir new ways new methods new ideas new horizons can come up from a body like this sir